Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Now we are on the last part of our holiday in Miyagi Prefecture. If you haven't seen the first three videos, I'll be putting the link on the description box below. In this video, I'll be showing you my visit at the famous Fox Village in Japan. Let's go! Zhao Fox Village is located just an hour drive southwest of Sendai. You may also get there by bus, train, or taxi. Please check the description box below for access link. So now we are on our way back to Utsunomiya, coming from Sendai. And on the way back home, we're gonna stop over at Zhao Fox Village and we're gonna check that out. I've been wanting to go there. <laughs> the cost per adult is 1,000 Japanese yen and children below age 12 is free of charge. The Fox Village is situated on the mountains and the place only accepts cash payments and the nearest ATM is a 17-minute drive down the foot of the mountain, so bringing cash is a must. It was the peak of summertime in Japan and the foxes doesn't look as fluffy because they are shedding. Before entering the enclosure, we are instructed to switch off the flash on our cameras, not to touch the foxes, and also put away anything the foxes can grab and chew on because they can be a bit mischievous at times. Most of the foxes are hanging out at the cabin in the middle of the open enclosure, which is the only place where visitors can feed them. So this platform at my back is like where you can feed the foxes. It's very stinky. It's really stinky, but there are signs that says that it's not coming from this place. There's actually a nearby piggery, so that's where the smell is coming from. Each food treats cost around 200 Japanese yen. Here, you'll see them fighting once in a while. Other foxes can be found taking naps inside wooden boxes and platforms around the area. It's actually my first time to hear what foxes sound like, and it goes like this. The open enclosure is home to over a hundred foxes bred in captivity. Older foxes roam around the enclosure freely and the younger ones are separated in another enclosure. This Inari shrine is inside the fox village and has several red tori gates. And this is built for a deity whose messenger is a fox. The facility is also said to conduct high preventive measures against Echinococcus, a parasite foxes may transfer to humans which is highly fatal. Overall, the experience is very unique because the foxes are quite tamed. I just hope that they could expand the area a little bit more to accommodate the fox population. If you plan to visit here, I think it's best to go during the cooler seasons when the foxes are more active and fluffy. So that's it guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get updated on my latest contents. Thank you for watching and see you again soon on my next video. What did the fox say? <laughs> to know more about me, please visit my website at www.veniceaka.com.